Hi everyone, it's me Brock from Trade and thank you for joining my live trading session where you are about to see me trade live and watch my PA live. The market is about to open up 0.5% SP, NASDAQ is up 0.65, it's a big gap up. And the overall trend is clearly up for the past two months or so. So we should prefer going long. I'll welcome my trading room member and start the trading session. But before that, please remember to hit that like button for us and plenty of links right here below where you can join me in my live trading room where I do call my picks live each and every day. Session is about to start. Let's get going. Okay, traders, market's uh, just about to open and uh, we're going to gap up in the S&P 0.5%, Nasdaq is up 0.66, that's a big gap up. We do have some very strong uh, stocks which are moving up like uh, GME, you can see it on my screen, it's uh, up 15%, big gap up, therefore we will be looking for a gap and go. But first, before we take that, if we take that, it needs to come down. We always need to see them come down, reverse and then go long. Otherwise, it's too dangerous. Now, we do have a pullback in GM, therefore we could go long over 31.92, getting ready to go long, not a big range, I'm long, GM, sorry, I didn't have time to post it, I'm going to post it now. It's a classic uh, gap and go. I'm posting uh, Jamie for short under 1550. Getting ready to short Jamie if it comes under 1550. GM sadly reached my target, but I missed it. I was actually mistaken there for a second. I'm short Jamie. I'm out of GM. Getting ready for a partial in GME. Under 15.10. Jimmy at my target price. I'm waiting a bit more. See, maybe I can get a little bit more. If it moves over 15.11, I'll take a partial. Over 15.10, I'll take a partial. Over 15.08, I'll take a partial. Let's break down 15, the whole number. No pullback, please. Took a partial in GME, maybe too early. Oh wow, definitely too early, definitely too early. I was waiting for this 15 breakdown, taking some more size here, covering some more size in GME. I'm going to go long NVIDIA over 485.50. I clicked the button. I thought it's going to move over. Actually got it below 485.50. But it's actually a small mistake. I thought it's about to go through. It did not. Anyway, I'm long NVIDIA. Hope it's going to turn out good. So there's OKTA under 68.50. The stock is down 5%. It's uh, clearly downtrending. I won't join this trend if it's going to come down under 68.50. comes under 486.30 I'll take a partial in NVIDIA took a partial in NVIDIA the S&P is uh, touching the highs right now so I think it's very likely that we will continue higher and Tesla will respond I'm going to go long over 250.70 OKTA I'm short I'm short OKTA actually missed uh, the time, the point where it crossed uh, 68.50. I joined it a little bit lower, not much. It's a big mover, so shouldn't be a big deal. I'm long Tesla. I've 
we've got another 100 shares in GME which will be stopped over 1550 I'm going to use a hard stop order there I don't want to watch it for 100 shares doesn't worth my time 1551 stop 100 shares I've got a, an order in the system right now getting ready to go long GM I'm long GM my second trade in GM first one was red come on okay T another 20 cents or so be nice let's go markets holding up you good okay okay T aim just touched my target and come on come on let's continue touching is not enough touching is not enough let's continue sellers under 67.80 that's what I need nice 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 a bit more a bit more yes there you go taking my partial now took my partial in OKTA getting ready for a partial in Tesla I want to see over lies good here we go breakout in Tesla okay okay sold I got my partial in Tesla Nvidia about to sell some more sold traders 30 minutes into the trading session today and as you can see I'm up uh, just over five thousand dollars actually with my open trades as you can see around here just over six thousand dollars so that's a good start for me just 30 minutes into trading and I do have one two three four winners and just one loser GM may turn around because if it's going to move over the highs I'm definitely going to have a winner there so thank you very much for following thank you for looking at this video and please hit that like button for us it will help us and again plenty of links below if you want to trade the same platform I do that's the Colmex Pro platform there's links below or join me in my live trading room where we can all trade together each and every day because I do call my picks live each and every day. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video.